real question is, do we have any Star Wars fans up in here? Let me hear you, boys. Truth about me, huge Star Wars nerd. Oh gosh, she's so pretty, dude. Jerome and I going on a nice little family trip this morning to get the car inspected. So like, since you're on the left-hand side, like, do you think people are gonna think you're the one driving, possibly? That's kind of funny. How funny would it be to go through like a drive-through? But like, not in reverse. Like, you would be the one to grab the food. All right, past inspection, boys. Dude, look how sick this guy is, man. You stunting so hard with your freaking socks. <laughs> you're a handsome guy. You know, I don't know if I tell you that much, but you're a good looking dude. Oh my God, this car is fast. <laughs> I need a manual swap in my life, though. This is a big boy. This is a lot of package. <laughs> As you guys saw yesterday, we have lots of goodies coming up for the R35. <laughs> I just started up my car, and there's a problem. My neighbors aren't coming out of their houses to ask me to turn the volume down, and that's just not okay. The R38 sounds so good when they are loud. As classic Evan Shanks would say, sorry neighbors. That definitely needs to be fixed. I, I know it's not even loud, bro. Come on. Jerome, seriously, dude. Do you want to give Armored Tricks a very special thank you for sending this out? They did send us an exhaust for my Porsche Cayman as well whenever I had one. I'm gonna open this sucker up and show you guys just how credible. This, okay, first off, let's just go over how humongous this box is. Jerome, lay down in front of it and like show them how long this box is. <laughs> That's a big boy, dude. All right, bud, come on, get up. Man. Come on. It's a full exhaust from the turbos back. We are getting rid of catalytic converters. I'm sorry. This is gonna be better for the environment than any machinery out there that blows black smoke into the air. So you guys can suh. We're gonna work on the art of going away from us today because whenever you cut close to yourself, you never know when you can slip and then go Pwah! And then no more babies. Look at that smoothness. Now I'm technically cutting towards myself again, so. Army Tricks has a really cool technology where you can quieten the exhaust or you can straight pipe it with the click of a button. Plugs into the OBD2 and you can control the exhaust. Here's my little button that I'll keep in the car. I'll elaborate more on these once we actually install the exhaust. But let's focus on getting this thing out of here and seeing the quality. You open it up, you got some more installation manual stuff like... Oh! And there it is. Oh, so sick. Now we're gonna have to take a swim into this. Jerome, not literally, man. You're gonna make a mess. You're in time out, bud. Stay there, dude. I don't want you making a mess with this. All right. I'm gonna dig around and get all this stuff out. Oh, that's a boy. Seriously, there's so much. There's just, there's so much in here, dude. Oh my God. <laughs> Okay, a little downpipe boy, I like that. That's easy and light. Here, you can hold this. If you wanna do something, you can hold this. Here's the other downpipe. So here we go. Two downpipes, some belly sweat. The midpipe, well, like, the, the J, I guess that's a midpipe. Also a midpipe, like a connecting midpipe. Now we have the big part. There's a lot in here. Oh wait, never mind. that's an exhaust tip. Oh, easy peasy. I like this, okay. Oh! 
Oh, I'm making such a mess. Dude, EPA is gonna hate me, dude. Okay. You wanna go in there and check for me and see if there's anything left? Oh my god. That's literally not what I asked you to do, man. I s Did you even check for me? I found something. Oh, dude, get out, just get out. One thing I've always loved about uh, army tricks is their quality. They do offer like titanium exhaust and stuff like that, especially for their higher end cars. But uh, this, I went ahead and was stainless and it is amazing. So what I want you guys to check out is like, look at the welds. Do you see my forehead right now? It's like, it's like a waterfall, Niagara. And here we go. Army tricks, supreme exhaust. You see that supreme? Supreme, that adds like $2,000 right there. So, for starters, we got downpipes. Those are gonna help a lot with power and flow straight out of the turbos. Next thing we got is a center exhaust. It's a pipe that connects the downpipes to the mid pipe. So technically it's like mid pipe one or mid pipe two. It's a Y pipe. Okay, we're gonna cut away from ourselves today. As my hand is right there, Okay, that's kind of wimpy. So this looks like it goes from three inch to either three and a half or four inch. Like that goes to big, big exhaust. This is probably somewhat of a resonator that doesn't do too much, but makes it to where it's not super raspy. That's what I usually do when I straight pipe a car. It doesn't change the volume at all, but it changes the tone. Super nice. Again, check out those welds. It's kind of hard to see. Looks so good. One long boy coming right up. <laughs> this, is a, this is a huge pipe. And what I do like is all of this is mandrel bent. Um, it's not like welded together. Like it is a nice mandrel bent, sick exhaust. This is what they use for uh, those Mongolian throat noises. <laughs> It actually hurt. Mongolian throat core. That's what it's called. No, that's not right. Oh, God, dude. <sighs> Guys, it's hot. But you know what's hotter? This humongous tuna fish that I just put in, ow, put into my lap. I cut my finger. Ooh, ooh. Oh my gosh. Bro, this is crazy. Ah, I sweat in my eye. Ow. I'm gonna stand up for this one. This is exciting. <laughs> I got a breeze up here, boys. All right, my camera's actually hot, too. Army Tricks. Nissan GTR R35 Performance Exhaust System. This is where all of the magic happens. As you can see, there's lots of different pipes. There is a, there is a full bypass, basically. So this straight pipe, that goes to the other exhausts. This straight pipe goes to the exhaust. But you can see it's got a little flan, it's got a little thing right here that opens and closes. That is based off of vacuum pressure. So in installing this, basically what you can do is there's a button that straight pipes your car and it goes through just a straight bypass straight out these exhausts and it's loud as hell. Or if you're nice and considerate like me and you don't want to wake your neighbors up all the time or piss them off, you can start your car with a colder start that goes through this giant muffler that's still probably way louder than the exhaust that's on it right now. And so if I flip it over for you to see, you want to be careful, this is very, very nice. As you can see, there's a few different ways the exhaust can go. That looks incredibly complicated and very cool. And as, dude, as you can still see, like, I mean, quality of this, considering it's coming from a big manufacturer, is pretty insane. Like, the TIG welding is great. I just love seeing the quality. And so this, hello, exhaust tips. And so you can, you can be gangster and have a little three inch exhaust if you want, but that's kind of dumb for GTR. Yeah, this is an option. <laughs> Trying not to scratch this. These are valuable. Look at my forehead, dude. It's disgusting. I will be transparent with you guys. Um, the deal to creating this exhaust is making an unbox video, an uh, install and like noise clip video. Um, so there are gonna be separate videos for this. But da -da -da! That's, that's metal, but this, we're carbon fibering all of the things. Usually I would not do that because I kind of like the burnt or even just like regular stainless steel tip look. Car's black, kind of wearing a sleek look. Plus this is gonna end up being filled with carbon anyways from the motor and so it'll end up just looking black. It'll end up looking nice. As you can kind of see, 
That is dry carbon fiber. That is a carbon fiber exhaust tip. I love the quality that Army Tricks has to offer, and I could not be more excited to put it on the car. So here's my beautiful mess from Army Tricks. Do you like it, Jerome? Just wait until you hear this tomorrow, man. I'll actually bring you with me. You haven't been to the shop yet. I know a lot of you guys know who Army Tricks is and about them and stuff like that, but I'll leave a link for you guys in the description if you want to check them out and see what kind of exhaust systems they have to offer. Whew, my advice for you guys today is drink water again, man. I'm just kidding. I just said it the other day. Uh, my advice today, you could be the nicest, kindest, most helpful, most thoughtful person on earth. And people will still hate you. People will still twist your words. And people will still find ways to judge you and take innocent things that you do and contort them. You could have never done anything wrong to someone, but they can still find a way to hate you. I want you guys to understand that. And so you can go through life understanding that not everybody's gonna always love you. I wish everybody did, because you know, that's all I wanted when growing up. I was like, oh, everybody should just love me, because I'm this nice person. But the answer to that is not, I, I see a lot of people that say, forgive my French, but I'm just gonna go ahead and copy people. The haters or them and move on. That's what people say. And that is, n even when people hate you, even when you have no reason to just continue sending love and being loving, you should still do it because that's what defines you as a person. The way you retaliate to those types of people or the way you continue to love even those types of people is really what makes you an amazing person. What differentiates you from ordinary to extraordinary. I love you guys. That's my advice for you today. Peace, and tomorrow, soccer's getting loud. <laughs> um, I've been playing too much Mario, so I've been kind of like copying his noises that he makes, but I want you to watch the two videos I have in front of you because you know why, they're good. All the stuff I make is good, like to be, f to be for real, but like watch both videos.